Okay, it's time to start the meeting, a uh, full meeting to order. Uh, let's start with the pledge and a moment of silence. We lost our regular flag, so we've improvised. That's right. I think it's a. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. We're going to start out this evening uh, to recognize the National Soil Judging Team. Uh, it's quite an accomplishment, and, and I asked Janet to, to invite them here tonight to uh, honor them. So, uh, yeah, Mr. Pearson, if you'd like Justin, to Justin, you can yeah. Yeah, go ahead and introduce yeah. and tell okay. the accomplishments. And sure. Uh, so, there are two divisions of the national contest. The, the one division is home site, so you're basically evaluating places for suitability for building a home site. And then the other one is land. Um, we competed in both. Some teams only pick one to compete in, but in Indiana, you're allowed to compete in both. Um, so in the home site division, our kids actually ended up fifth place team. Um, and then in the land judging, we ended up as uh, the third place team. So um, in the time that I've been here, this is by far the best that we've ever done. Um, I know maybe in the legendary side D years they had some better um, finishes than that, but uh, I'm super proud of them. Uh, I said, you know, sometimes I judge a trip more on how much kids bicker and how much they argue and complain about where we eat and this and that. We had none of that on this trip. Um, our weather was not cooperative. It rained on us two of the three days that we practiced. Uh, but they didn't complain, they worked hard, and, uh, and they re re were rewarded for their efforts. So I'm extremely proud of them. Um, I appreciate the board and I appreciate the school for allowing us to participate and go and for helping us financially in that endeavor as well. So I'll let each one of these guys kind of stand up and introduce themselves and maybe say their favorite memory from the trip. Uh, I'm Dryden Vance. Um, I'd say one of my favorite things was getting to go to the National Stockyards. I thought the Stockyard City and just that whole area was pretty cool. There was a good, good restaurant there. The Stockyards themselves were pretty good and were really interesting. So that was my favorite part. My name is Haley Jones. My favorite part was probably the Stockyards because I got to see cowboys and what they do when they're wrangling cattle. I'm Sammy Shriver. I think my favorite part of the trip was getting to go to the Onondaga, Onondaga Caves. Uh, those are in Missouri. It was really cool to see something so ancient, I guess. It's been there this whole time, and it's something that, we, you know, they just recently found. So that was really cool. And I just want to thank the school board and um, everyone for allowing us to participate in such, a, such an eye-opening trip. It was really neat. I'm Jesse Shriver, and I think my favorite moment was also the stockyards. I really like cattle and I think it's cool to see so many of them in one place. How many teams were there? Um, in, in, there's two different divisions, 4-H and FFA, and between everybody there was about 200 teams. So, so. Quite a yeah. yeah. And from my experience, I told them before, 45 years ago I was on a team out there, and, and that's something you'll always remember. You know the, the things you did and the experience you had and uh, you know the competition and uh, all the hard work you put into it uh, uh, you did an excellent job uh, the number of teams you're competing against from all over the country so congratulations another thing that's kind of fun um, you know in indiana when we go to the state contest every school is kind of out for themselves and you're trying to, to do your best and earn the right to go when you do go to the national contest, Indiana gets to see, send uh, five different teams in FFA and five different teams in 4-H. Um, so out there, it's like Indiana works together um, because we want Indiana to do well. So I know these kids form some relationships and some friendships with other schools, you know, that are gonna last a lifetime. So that was pretty fun for them as well. Well, thank you. Welcome, 
stay or you're welcome to leave. <laughs> Thanks again. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> okay. Uh, financial report. Rubo claims 15409 through 15611, totaling $1,388,583.06. Anybody have any questions on claims okay any motion to approve the claims so moved second any motion by jenny second by sandy any discussion all in favor right in please okay motion carries six zero payroll everybody have time to There's no questions and need a motion to approve the payroll. So moved. I make a motion. Okay, motion by Stacy. Second. Second by Jenny. Any other discussion? All in favor. Motion carried is 6 0. Okay, uh, funds are for. Okay, the education fund, um, we had receipts of $994,972.60. Expenses of $859,119, and we also made the monthly transfer of $138,000 to the operations fund, which left us with a cash balance of $264,246.88 in the education fund. Debt service fund uh, receipts of $6,451.71, uh, expenses of $3,250. Left us with a cash balance of one million nine hundred twelve thousand five hundred fourteen dollars and eighty five cents. Debt service fund. In the operations fund. We had receipts of thirty five thousand seven hundred twelve dollars and sixteen cents. Transfer from the education fund of one hundred thirty eight thousand dollars, and expenses of four hundred eight thousand three hundred twenty three dollars and ninety eight cents, which left left us with a cash balance of one million six hundred thirty nine dollars. One million six hundred thirty-nine thousand seven hundred fifty-seven dollars and sixteen cents. Any questions? Not uh, any motion to approve the funds. Before. So moved. Okay, motion with Sandy. Second. Second by Joe. Any other discussion? All in favor? Motion carries six zero. Hey, thanks, Doc. Okay. Under consent items, we have the minutes of April 15th, regular board meeting. Any additions or corrections? Okay, if not, uh, we have the minutes of the April 18th, special board meeting. <clears throat> Any additions or corrections? Minutes of the May 6th, special board meeting. Any additions or corrections? And the minutes of the May 6th study session. Any additions or corrections? Okay, if not, we need a motion to approve the consent items. So moved. Okay, motion by Sandy. Second. Second by Jenny. Your discussion. All in favor? Okay, moving on to uh, approval of the RMS handbook changes to 2019 2000. I think Oscar is prepared to talk about those, even though Candy probably did all of the. <laughs> I yeah. that Oscar will be the one to speak. She even gave me this paper when I walked in today, so <laughs> thank you, Candy. <clears throat> if you look at it, she does a great job of breaking it down, so we don't have to get through the whole handbook. But on page 9, 10, and 14, in regards to cell phones, dress code, and tobacco, um, it's just kind of keeping up with the changes in the times um, with the cell phones and the electronic devices. Uh, it's a battle that Cassie and I have talked about and as long as it's not disrupting the educational environment it's okay that it's in their pocket uh, instead of having to be in their locker we get a lot of pushback on that from parents and students and so we're kind of changing with that the dress code um, a lot of the girls now they sell those shirts that covers the shoulder then has a hole and then 
covers the rest of the arm. I guess that's the end fashion. And so as long as the shoulder's covered, uh, we're gonna go ahead and allow them to do that as long as it's not a cut off. And then um, we've said fingertip length for so long that now I guess Cassie wants to go with mid thigh and or fingertip length is what she would like it to say. And that gives her a little bit of leeway because some young ladies' arms are a lot longer than others. And we get between dress code and electronic devices, that's the most pushback we get in the building when it comes to the handbook. So we're just trying to meet them where they're at. And then the tobacco, it just adds the vaping and electronic cigarette issues that we are starting to see across the district to make sure we do that. And then on page 16, talking about how we're utilizing four county and the, um, if you get in there that we will utilize some uh, appropriate counseling while you're in there to try and help you understand why the behavior of the action was not appropriate. And so that's utilizing our four county counselors is what that is on page 16. Any questions on those before I jump to the next one? Then the grading scale, I don't know if it's been one or two years now, the high school has been on the 4.0 scale and we were still on the 12.0 scale, which uh, really causes a problem when we have our Spanish and ag and technology, art, facts, the plethora of high school classes we offer to our eighth graders, um, trying to translate that over becomes a headache for Candy and our high school guidance department. And so this will just put us in line with Mr. Keesling's building and make it easier for transcripts, grade reporting for those students and parents and our uh, own faculty and staff. So that's why we're changing, or we'd like to implement it to be just like the high schools. Question on that? And that's a mirror image of what is in Mr. Keesling's handbook. We just copied and pasted it, so. I actually would like to discuss that, but it's, I applaud the decision to have the middle school and high school the same. I was concerned when we changed it a couple of years ago, <coughs> and I would like to bring that up again. Mathematically, we do not have equal spacing between the points, and I think we should have equal spacing between the points. So if a B plus is 87 to 89%, then the A plus should reflect that same amount of percentage points. So in other words, if you look on there the 4.0, an A covers six different percentage points, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, and 99. Those all are given the same weight. In no other grade on there are they given the same weight. So I would like to see both the middle and the high school change to have those be equal spacing. Now, I do understand that means the A plus would be more than just 100%, but that's what we've done with the other pluses as well. And I think it's unfair to have that much of a different, or have that much of a weighting just in that one part of the A. So how would you do the A plus then if you'd have I would have A plus be either 97 percent to 100 or because those are three 90, 87, 80, 89 or you could do 98 percent to 100 and that might be the best way to do that. Okay. Any other questions or comments? Jenny is that a question for across the board or because we're talking about the middle school program right now. Yes, I would like to see that change to the high school as well. I do think it's wise to have the middle school and the high school be consistent, which is what right. it looks like was the attempt here. And so if that needs to be discussed at a different time or place, I think some of the issue was, to a little bit of background, is that they didn't even want to have an A+. Plus. But again, if we're going to have pluses and minuses, we need to have pluses and minuses for each grade. If we don't want an A plus, then we shouldn't have a B plus or a C plus or a D plus either. It should be A, B, C, D, which that could be a discussion point. But if we're going to do pluses and minuses, I would like to <coughs> restate that I would like it to be 98% to 100% instead of just 100%. Chris, we haven't adopted your handbook yet. No, I was just getting ready to say it's funny that she brought that up because I had that same discussion uh, with counselors and uh, Mrs. Atkinson, regarding the same thing, I feel really just like you do, that we need to make the same adjustment between the A and the A plus, meaning basically, as you said, split the difference 
we're looking at 94 to 97 percent would be the A range, and then 98, 99, 100 would be the A plus. So in that regard, I, I will hardly agree. Uh, that was just brought up the other day when we were looking at that. It makes sense. Yeah, it does. And then, and then Oscar, are you willing at that point, yeah, once it's adopted, to make sure that we mirror the high school, whatever that might be? I want ours to mirror the high school because when it comes to inputting grades for those eighth graders when they go over there, it's, it becomes a nightmare trying to go from 12 to 4. I just want it to be very similar, <coughs> identical to whatever Mr. Keith said. One of the things that you run into with the A plus is the weight of grade. And that's where it, you start to see the uh, 94 to 99 range it's it's taking into account that yes we have a hundred but you're looking also at a weighted grade that can increase you to 4.3 so that's that's where it it, it, it it gets a little dicey on that but I, I think we can work through that easy enough so we'll take that back and discuss it yeah. as a team and bring that recommendation okay I'm sorry yeah, Tom, do you want to table this until the whole thing until later, or just table the page twenty of this, do the rest of it, and then bring it all back? That was time. going to be my next question. If we left out the grade part, page twenty, for later discussion and approval, then uh, vote on uh, the changes, the rest of the handbook. Right. Approval. Yeah. Is that okay, there? Okay. We'll need a motion to approve the handbook without page 20, the further review of page 20 on the grading scale. <clears throat> so we need a motion to approve uh, the RMS handbook changes. I make a motion, except for page 20. Okay. Motion by Stacy. I'll second. And second by Joe. Any other discussion? All in favor? Hey, motion carries 6 -2. Thanks, Oscar. Awesome. Approval of the High Ability Handbook. So I know um, Jen had a chance to talk to everybody at the study session. Do you mind just uh, with media and everybody here to kind of go through and, and highlight some of the <coughs> changes here? I didn't do the High Ability Handbook. Stephanie did. Oh, Stephanie did. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, <laughs> what was I thinking? What happens when I sit in the front? Yeah. <laughs> It used yeah, to be under the student services. It did, thank you very yes, much. Yeah. Yeah. It used to be in charge. Well, go ahead. <laughs> so I'm trying to think of some of the changes that she outlined at the meeting. Um, going through here. She mainly mentioned wording, that okay. the terminology was outdated that was being used. And in regards to testing and high ability and, yeah. If there were any other questions at that time at the study session, I know she was there. Did any board members have any questions? Mm -hmm. okay. uh, we a motion to approve the high ability handbook as presented. So moved. Okay, motion by Jenny. Second. Second by Sandy. Any other discussion? All in favor? Okay, motion to carry six here. Approval of textbook rental fees, grades K through eight. So again, we um, tried to drill down on textbooks and then in regards to the consumables, uh, typically there is an increase in regards to consumables as inflation goes up. What you'll notice here are in uh, just a few of the grade areas, I believe that the maximum increase would have been $5 for any one class in regards to increase in textbooks and, consu and consumables. Um, this would be the plan for kindergarten through eighth grade. The high school, we're still working on that in regards to the multitude of classes and textbooks and college credits and the books that they um, are looking at. So we should be able to bring that to you in June. And then we can't really put a grade level price on the high school because it's dependent upon their schedule and what coursework and what track that they want to go through. And as always, we're willing to work with parents. We're, we've uh, done payment plans. We do credit card, those types of things. So we want to make it as easy as we can on parents to be able to make those, um, to make sure that they uh, pay those fees. And these are versus that for the year? Correct, for the entire year, for that grade level. The 
most uh, increase was a $5 increase. Some even say the same, correct? Exactly, exactly. Okay, any questions? It's mostly of you know, we do a lot of our homework <coughs> and studying on these things in our study sessions, so if it seems like we're just reading them and voting on them, it, that's not the case. We, the board takes a lot of time considering and studying these things at the study sessions, so. So we will need a uh, motion to approve textbook rental fees, K grades K through eight. A motion? I'll make a motion to approve. Okay, motion by Stacy. I'll second it. Second by Sandy. Any discussion? Okay. Okay, motion to carry six seven. Okay. Uh, the next is the uh, approval of the third rating of various policies. Policies, I'll read them all, 8340, 2623, 8120, 4419.01, 3419.01, 3419.01, 1520.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620.81, 1620
City Pool, RMS, PBIS program, by free day passes. B&K, RMS, PBIS program, $20 gift certificate and root beer tokens. Um, Donald Beverly Daywolf, $50 from FFA auction. Anonymous donor, year-end medals for RMS Champions Together athletes. Judas Jennings, school supplies and hygiene items for RMS. RTC, $100, prom photo booth. Donorschoose.org, various donors turn $55 to Riddle. Optimus Club, turn $50 for ZBN GoPro camera and equipment. And Fulton County Solid Waste District, $500 to RMS for yearly recycling. <coughs> Are there any additions? Is that good more? I do. I have three Listen. more actually. Okay. <laughs> I have um, an anonymous donation uh, refrigerator for our PBIS lounge. Um, when they have the pizza parties and things, they have uh, water and stuff that they like, like to keep cold for that. Um, and then I have a refrigerator from Rob and Misty Kreit for our teacher's lounge. Ours took a nose dive and they were getting a new one, so we are taking their one from their home that's supposed to arrive tomorrow, I think, Oscar. Um, and then I also have um, from Nate Basham a virtual reality headset that's going to be um, part of our PBIS prize program. Thanks, okay, with, with those additions to the donations, were there any questions? I do. I have a question. I just, I am just wondering about the two thousand some dollars for the ukuleles. Does Does Luke want us to approve that one? <laughs> <laughs> Down at the end. <laughs> okay. Is that one class? That'll be for, yes, Ms. Martin's fifth grade uh, choir class. So all the fifth grade classes. Okay, that's, that that's program, what I wanted. Yes, all fifth okay. grade classes will okay. be participating. Ms. Martin is the music teacher. Okay. So that's for the ukuleles plus the program? Yeah, plus the program. I think there's curriculum that, that goes with that. In the okay. class. Are we going to have a ukulele? Fingers crossed. <laughs> <laughs> Recorders, you can lay you know, whatever. Yeah. Well, that'll be something that could continue. Okay, all right. Okay. Any other questions? Oh, yeah. If not, I uh, need a motion to approve the donations. So moves. Okay, motion by Jenny. Second. Second by Sandy. On your discussion. All in favor. Okay, motion carries 6 0. And once again, uh, just the, the, the community donations, uh, you know, the giving to the school corporation is unbelievable. I mean, every month, uh, what uh, the thousands of dollars we see here. So once again, thank you, community. Okay, a wrestling trip to Jeff Jordan State Trip, uh, State Champ Camp in Ohio. Mr. Kiesling, do you want to share just a little bit in regards to? Uh, yeah. It's, uh, as it indicates, St. Paris, uh, Ohio, St. Paris Graham High School. Uh, pretty much a yearly thing that they do a lot of team building with and they go out there for this camp. Um, and it involves all the coaches and players, like the grades 9 through 12. Um, just a good positive experience for the kids to go and be a part of. Everybody have a chance to go through the uh, what to, what what's the cost for the school? Just the mini bus? Mini bus is what okay. you're taking. Okay. Yeah. The rest of us by the kids. Okay. The wrestling program. Any other questions? Now I need a motion to approve the wrestling field trip to Jeff Jordan State Champ Camp in Ohio. I'll motion. Okay, motion by Kyle. I'll second. Second by Joe. Any other discussion? All in favor? Okay, motion carries 6 0. Right, moving on to the personnel. <coughs> okay, we have quite a long 
list. It's that time of year, right? Get people lined up. Okay, for hiring, Jamie Johnson, dyslexia specialist. Um, I'm sorry, can, um, I need to be excluded from the CIA coaches because for the vote. Okay. I just want to make a note of that. No, and I will also uh, exclude from uh, summer school. I'm sure is that, yeah. Okay, uh, Ricky Myers, maintenance specialist for grounds. Sky Leslie, substitute bus driver. FMLA, Stacy Stasiak, Columbia Special Needs, April 23rd through May 6th of 19. Retirement, Dave Dan Hauser, musical instrumental, music effective 529. Resignations, Nate Kimmel, RMS, uh, maintenance effective 531.19. Jay Wilson, Learning Center, night custodian, part-time, seasonally, seasonal effective uh, May 17th of 19. Elizabeth Todd, Riddle, third grade, effective end of school year. Brenda Eber, middle study skills, exploring college and careers, a nutrition wellness teacher, effective last day of the 2018-19 school year. Uh, Leah Sutton, high school, or high, yeah, high school cafeteria, effective uh, April 24th. Spring Enrichment, Amy Banks, Columbia Potawatomi Zoo, Pay rate $150 stipend. High school, summer school, Ken Hughes, uh, Algebra 1, Charlie Schwank, BE, Government, Stony Stasiak, Agriculture, SAE, Justin Pearson, English, Trevor Brown, Health, Katie Felty, Special Education Instructor, Felix Amandi, Summer Intercession, Teresa Kimmel, Riddle Instructional Assistant, Summer I Read, Joanna Johnson, June 3rd to the 14th of 19. Uh, Corinne Hines, Title I, Instructional Assistant, June 6th to the 14th. Amy Freeman, June 4th. Uh, Jelaine Rohr, June 3rd and June 5th. CIA coaches, Jelaine Rohr, Riddle, 2019-20 and 2021, pay rate of $3,000. Joanna Johnson, Riddle, 2019-20 and 2021, pay rate $3,000. Nikki Obermeyer, Riddle, 2019-20, 20 and 21, pay rate $3,000. Hope Shally, um, high pay rate $1,500. Jesse Atkinson, high pay rate $1,500. Lucas Shainholz, high pay rate $1,500. Trevor Brown, High pay rate of $1,500. Jenny Snyder, high pay rate $1,500. Uh, Leah Hilton, lender, pay rate $1,500. Amy Blackburn, pay rate $1,500. Rachel Hazelby, high pay rate $1,500. Then we have uh, some additions that came in today. High school, summer school, Amy Blackburn, health, Terry Screen, PE. And we have a new hire, Carol Shelburne, Special Needs Instructional Assistant at Columbia, pay rate of nine dollars and forty-seven cents. There any questions? So at the high school, we're going to be having two PE classes for yeah. seven. Their enrollment is up quite a bit, pretty significantly. Any other questions? Okay. Uh, I asked to approve uh, uh, the uh, personnel report uh, and we'll pull uh, Lucas Shainhouse and Charlie Schwank out at this time. So uh, need a motion to approve. I move we approve the personnel reports okay. except for Charlie Schwank and Lucas Shainhouse. All right. Motion. Second. Second. Second by Sam. All in favor? Okay, motion carries 6 0. And now we'll need a motion to approve uh, Lucas Shane Host, our CIA coach, and Charlie Schwank as a PE. And uh, Stacy and I will abstain. So we need a motion to approve those two. So moved. Okay, motion by Sandy. Second. 
second by either Joe. Either one. one. Okay. All in favor? Okay. Motion carries four and two abstention. Okay. Good thing we can't. Six people. <laughs> yeah. yeah, just just got it. Huh? <laughs> They'd have been without a job. <laughs> okay, superintendent business. So just a gentle reminder that we do have school. Uh, we have two makeup days next week, so we will be back in session next Tuesday and Wednesday. And again, um, all of our e-learning days did count. Uh, so a thank you to the teachers and parents and technology and all of the administrators who made those e-learning days count or we may be here until uh, June but um, just wanted to remind parents that next Tuesday and Wednesday are makeup days um, additionally we were meeting as an administrative team today and we have um, determined that registration dates we will have a booth available during the fair week of the 8th through the 12th it was a great uh, opportunity for parents who were there or involved in the fair to come out to sign up to to do a little bit of meet and greet um, we will also coordinate for some parents um, getting to the fair was not feasible and so we want to make sure that we are helping those parents as well so we're going to coordinate with our macbook cells uh, to have uh, the, a facility here open while macbook cells are going on they can also do registration here at the Learning Center so uh, we'll have people on staff to help with that and we'll also be here for those sales and then we will uh, begin online registration if you choose just to do this at home on your free time on your computer there or um, uh, shooting to open that on July 1st and we'll close that on July 12th so as we continue to drill down on those dates and informations and times we'll be sure to pass that out but uh, you'll be sure and see us at the fair and we'll make sure that we get those online registration dates out to the community as well um, just it's hard to believe another year is down so as my administrative staff is sitting here thank you all for your hard work and diligence and support of our community good thank you board have any questions comments anybody in the audience have anything to say or comment Thank you for breakfast last week for our staff. I know they appreciate, appreciate all the hard work. Definitely deserving of it, so thank you for taking care of it. I came to the uh, Learning Center last Wednesday. And that, Jason, I said, it's the first time I've gone any place but Columbia. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Kyle, Kyle stepped up and took care of business. I mean, it was, wasn't the same without you, Sandy, but he, he, was, he was solo over there running the show. You're welcome to come back anytime. Now. Okay. Right. Okay. If you just want to have breakfast, we have breakfast every morning. I know. I know. Come on over anytime. I can come anytime I want to, yes, but it, it was different here. Yeah. It's very different. They come in at different times, you know, and it's not like a little collected bunch that comes in all at one time, so. It was different, but it was nice, and they were appreciative. Thank you all. So, Appreciate all the hard work, the oh. administration, and staff, and everybody. Another year on your belt, so congratulations. Good yeah. job. Thank you. Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll adjourn the meeting then. Thank you. <laughs>